Hello everyone and welcome back to Eastward. I'm ah, I'm Ranyako, but you're not already. So yeah, let's uh, a little see if we can make something more with this. to get the hang of the timing just a bit at least Let's see what's this way, shall we? Wake Valley. Oh. Well, that's disappointing. Hmm. That goes out. That goes out somewhere. Oh, well. I can probably get back the. What's the point of having fast travel <laughs> if there isn't any points to fast travel to? Oh well. Maybe if I'm here. No, I just disabled fast travel entirely. Huh. Sir. back at least somewhat hmm? oh. oh well we should be almost there already yeah okay that was that didn't take too long We can finally go to what our objective was. Over here. Hmm. That's suspicious. How many do we have now? 
suena fuera no, pero... Should be around here somewhere. Did those mice just explode? <laughs> yes, yes, they did. Way, I suppose. Actually, why did I not think of going here? Random house. Lord. anything I can interact with? No, I'm besides the door again. Hmm. Something about that feels suspicious, you know? Way, I suppose. Hello, the glassy berry tree. Yeah, look, look, the glassy berry tree. I say, young lass, what do you mean by I am a man's fruit tree? Oh, hello. Um, could I ask whether this is the glassy berry tree? Ah, oh, it is. Can I infer that you and this gentleman aim to ensnare its fruit? We sure do. We duck! Duck from whence you came! If you don't, I'm afraid you'll have to see me at my worst. You're like enough friends of those treacherous beguilers. I shan't give them any fruit, and I shan't give any to you either. Wait right there! The Sonic Punk is here! Mr. The Sonic Punk? Well, if it isn't the princess. Still playing with your mechanical doodads, I see. <laughs> mm -hmm, yes, uh, the princess did indeed send me. It seems I might have been mistaken about you two saplings. I say, by Lily, are you referring to old Lee the Smokestack? Smokestack. One and the same. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Excellent, just excellent. All right then, young lady. I'll let you partake of my fruit. Really? Now, tell me. Tell me. That scoundrel is he still always going on about how he never loses. I always did have an inauspicious feeling about that boy. Someone needs to take him down a peg. Never did know what your grandfather saw in him. Grandfather? Um, um, yes! Grandpa, Grandpa, old body, old pal, you're so right! No, then, where was I? 
You take this fruit now, you hear? And you mix it right up into a jam as soon as you're able. The taste will be absolutely spoiled otherwise. Cassie berries. Wow, yeah, look, it's a sight shiny as glass. As it should be, I planted it after all. And to think, it's that cheapsteak lead that's going to be partaking of it. The injustice. Yeah, let's go back, John. This wealthy lead gets a lot of this. Alright, time to take the train station, I suppose. That's probably the faster option. We can take the train, right? Exploded on its own. Uh, do I have any food that's not worth very much? Could just eat that one. Oh, whoops. Press V one too many times, I suppose. <coughs> you know what? They're not worth the ammo. to just take the train here, hopefully. Ooh, fancy. Good day. Welcome to the new damn city subway service. Where would you like to go? Oh. So there is a hot springs we could technically go to, but... We don't need to get right back with the glacier, so let's do that. something awful. That's sealed off cliff on the way to Quake Valley. It might not look it, but it's hiding a fantastic secret. Go check it out. I think I already found that one. Oh well. My mother is getting this right back over here. Excuse me? Oh, excuse me. But please. My dad is dying. What? Dying? You mean William? What happened? Yes, he's very sick. That doctor said the only thing that could save him are glassy berries. Glassy berries? We got those right here. Here, you take them. You need them a lot more than us. Please, he only has one night to, to... Wow, really? You, you, you give them to me? No, maybe I didn't even need this story. Yeah, we should go see William and make sure he's okay. Uh, uh, you can't. Uh, I mean, the doctor, yeah, the doctor. He, he's saying uh, no one should bother him right now. The doctor? We should definitely listen to the doctor then. And you was hurt, the doctor helped him too. He saved your life. You should hurry back then. The doctor's probably waiting. If you need anything else, just ask, okay? We're staying in this house right here. Y yeah, uh, yeah. Anyway, the thanks. You guys are pretty great. 
hope we didn't feel sadder soon. You poor naive Sam. I'm coming in. Did you find the berry? Oh, it's you. Don't look so happy to see me. Well, aren't you even going to serve me some tea? Serve yourself. Oof. Still have all this old junk? Why bother? And no smoking. This place hasn't changed a bit. Don't you touch anything? Oof. A roll. If you're going to serve me a roll, surely you must also have. Is it very young? Am I right or am I right? You just wait, this jam is gonna knock your socks off. We're back. Ali. You give it away? Someone was sick? Well, I suppose that does take precedence. Is it not ready yet? Shouldn't I be smelling something fruity by now? We're um, just making it now, it will be ready in a flash. This is bad. Looks like we've got no choice, we're gonna have to use that. That? <clears throat> and that. We'll replace the berry with this. Ghost peppers? Exactly, ghost pepper, yeah. That cannot possibly... It's supposed to be jam. Where's the rich aroma? The fruity bouquet. Well, the singers probably ruined your sense of smell. This color isn't it a bit too different for a jam. I've just never had freshly made jam before. It's always like this. Why do I feel a strange sense of foreboding? <laughs> That's just your growing excitement. Oh no, take a bite. Oh no. Is it so spicy? What's wrong with spicy, huh? It's the spice of life after all. Don't patronize me. You told me I'd be having Lizzie Berry Jam. Holy God, what's this spicy mess? More like a spicy masterpiece. I'm back. No problems out past the border. Oh, Liz here. Don't tell me that's all the spicy jam, is it? You see, tell him, tell him, how, tell him how great my spicy jam is. I, um, I mean, it's, uh... <laughs> Why don't we just leave it at that then, huh? I look forward to your next creation. Try not to disappoint me next time. Alright, he did give us three attempts, didn't he? Here it is, look, this is Lily before he turned into a big poof. He was a looker. What's he wearing? He almost looks like a, a rookie knight. Oh, he used to be a major earthborn farm boy. Farm boy? Ah, right. You don't know that word, do you? Just need someone as like an uber fan of something. The point of being just a little crazy. <laughs> it's one of those words from like ancient times. What about this, huh? You see a fanboy of this too? Ah, uh, let me see, let me see. Oh gosh, right. I completely forgot about this. What is it? What is it? The big damn crab pot. Lily used to go wild about this. John. That's it, big damn crab pot. 
We need to find the big time crab and make the biggest time crab boat beats ever seen. I guess we have an objective now. But where do we need to go? Oh, right over there. Makes sense. I'm afraid to this talk has already been bought up by a greedy landlord. But I've heard tell the dragon markets in its final stages of opera. Perhaps you'll find a bit of luck there. Okay, that's... oh, over there. Didn't you say you weren't going to the compilers today, now? Yeah, well, with the old black hole blast like that, I had to give it a try. I mean, how the hell am I supposed to get 50 stinking rich? If I don't pop a squad on the hole, am I right? 50 stinking rich, more like 50 stinking poor. You got that right, what a load of crook. What am I supposed to tell the wife? Hey, you! You don't think you could learn about I bought a few coins, do you? I cannot switch side characters. Interesting. Hmm. I actually wanted to give them some coin. Oh yeah, where's the... I think it was right over here, right? So clearly missed something probably in the first chapter there. Oh well, let's go to the dragon market I suppose. Right down here. Ooh. Crystal Lake sure is quiet at night. Are there any more people actually selling stuff? Hmm. So late and I still ain't come back yet. I really know how to make a person worry. That, that's just a wall, isn't it? There's this one. Uh, I'm sorry, what? You didn't hear this from me, man, but I've heard tell there's something unbelievable hidden deep in the dam. Okay, well, I guess we can take a look around. Outside, to the near the world scattered father war, I know not what course tricks they conspire. Hmm. What do you have to say? The people around here are quite poor. So poor, in fact, that they don't even have anything for me to keep. So you don't have to worry about your memories being mixed up with anything weird. The idea that that could happen is kinda terrifying. Oh! Hello, you! So, we meet again. The heavy curtain of steam, the odious smell of sludge. This fall weather way hasn't changed a bit. 
To this day it remains Needham City's most desolate, most dangerous haunt. And yet, it was once the playground of a small child. You see, this child loved to study creepy crawlies. His peculiar hobby of his earned him a reputation as a bit of an old boy. Names, disparaging looks, the occasional hand to the nose. He'd gotten it all, but down here, the darkness welcomed him, and the spiders accepted him as their friend. He decided he would live here, merging less and less often out into the world above. The people began to forget him. What happened to him? Well, they say he himself turned into a spider, but I can't be sure myself. After all, I don't speak spider. Okay then. That's uh, quite the story. Oh, there's the chest. There we go. It's just very salty. Later we were running into people's songs. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Bye. Mm. We should go and open up my space spa spice stunt here. story about it. You see, there was once a story going around among the kids of the city. The gate was made from the jaws of a river dragon, they said. And if you passed through the gate on the night of a full moon, you'd be whisked away to the mighty dragon palace. One especially brave boy decided he was going to try it. Only no one ever saw him again. That year saw the most rain the city had seen in a long time and the wheat harvest was particularly bountiful. Since then, whenever a bad season rolls around, people joke that they should send another child to the Dragon Palace. That's dark humor, all right? You're sure you two with fun incompetence can handle it? You can stake your whole life on us, my man! We're only the strongest, smartest, toothless gents this side of the dam. Mr. Chavez, sir. We'll um, have all them king crafts to you tomorrow, first thing. Skull Summer. Not sure what kind of scout you are, or how to sell any, but you know, why not? Work you by, Summer, right? I'll hire you for the job. Score, man! Come on, bro, let's go celebrate. We're thinking the same thing, bro. And I got the perfect idea, too. Ho ho ho. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh well. If it's crab you folks are after, you've come to the Le Bon Person. Stop by the King Crab tomorrow. And you'll be able to partake in. You don't see this most exciting crab experience. Yeah, did you hear them? Let's go to Alba. We're gonna win for sure tomorrow. Can we just keep going down? No, I I guess I don't get a choice. <sighs> Why is this thing on? Why is it blinking at me? What on earth? What on earth indeed? You! How could... what is... A bit slow on the uptake, are we? Isn't there something you want to say to me? For instance, what is going on here? Clearly, you really are nothing more than a child. 
that, that's not true. I am the harvester, the reaper of humanity. Is that so? And yet, you couldn't even figure out how to turn this on. That's, well... No matter, I'll give you a new toy to play with. You'd like that, wouldn't you? You don't mean... Oh no... This guy, yeah? We need to get, get King Crafts for the craft put and take it down! I guess we can go check on the king, king crab real quick and probably not have thing found any. Um, are you alright there? Um, hmm. Uh, hello? We're here to buy some. I know what you be looking for, just curry those. This is what everyone's waiting for at this of the game. But my first my Chevys. He left for the fort and there's been nearly a sign of him since. Yeah, let's go to the dragon market and take a look. Maybe something happened to him. Okay. Well, anyway, I hope you all have fun. And I'll see you next time when I guess we'll go to the dragon market. We have now officially explored this whole map, which means clearly things are about to get really, really bad. Bye bye